I, I, I was uh, thinking about how we all ended up here. And, and um, you know, it, it's so important, I think, to have an attitude of gratitude, especially as you build success in the business and you, you make money and you get a ton of friends and, and life just starts to get really fun and really good. And, um, and then you start coming to these events and maybe one of you are going to cross stage this weekend. You know, we have a whole bunch of different recognition and you're going to cross stage and we're all going to cheer for you or maybe you've hit a goal, maybe even missed a goal. But what happens is somewhere, think how... Think how it happened that you ended up in this chair this weekend. I know, I know I met a guy just at a house meeting in my house a couple, not even weeks ago, and, um, and he got talked into coming here, and his name's Justin, and he jumped on in a couple days' notice. I know somebody was outside the hotel, and they, Wayne was telling me that uh, someone showed them the idea, I think yesterday, and, or today, sold them a ticket, and they're here tonight. So... It, I, so let me ask you, when did you receive the gift? When did you receive the gift that put you here? I remember for me, you know, the, the, I was a diver in the Navy, and this guy who showed me a business, he was an officer. So right away, we didn't trust each other further than we can throw each other. And, and in fact, he just totally disliked me. I don't know why. Um, but uh, he had us told dislike, and I kind of disliked him, so it was mutual. But I said, I don't care, because I can get rich. Right? That was kind of anything I didn't like, that was my answer. How many people here right now don't like something about your current source of income? <laughs> right? How, really, how many people don't like something about what you currently do for money? But you do it anyways. You do it anyways, right? So I have somebody say, I don't know if I like to do that. And what's that got to do with it? There's a ton of things I didn't like about what I used to do, but I did it anyways. And here's the thing. It was only going to make me a living. I hate it. I will use the word, I, I very, I hate using the word hate. Um, but, uh, I, you know, I hated diving. But I did it because it was the, the best pay the best paid job that I could get in the military at the time, we were doing this pay freeze. It was only supposed to last a year, and it lasted seven years. I was only in the Navy for eight. My mom sent me to the military because she thought that we didn't pay taxes. Did anybody ever hear that before? My mom, she still thinks that people who work for the government don't pay taxes. <laughs> Somebody said, well, Claude, it's important that you like what you do for a living. It's you like what you do for a living. Yeah, that'd be nice. That'd be really cool if that was the case. But very, very rarely does that happen. You know, if you don't like being in business, do it anyways for a couple of years, get the results, and then retire. Right? It's way better than doing something you don't like for 45 years and never retiring. You know, sometimes, uh, you know, when you sat and you saw this idea, because every one of you to end up here, you received a gift. We all have done something different with this gift so far. We're all at a different point along the way, making different money from it, uh, maybe having different tax write-offs from it. We've gotten different things from it. You know, I remember we do a, a non-denominational church service on Sunday morning. The only reason I went to my first church service is because they said, oh, the, the millionaire guy that you saw on stage Friday night, he's going to be speaking on Sunday. And I thought, what if they give out? Like a key secret at that thing, and I'm not there. And so that's what made me go to my very first Sunday and, um, and haven't missed one since. So I, I know that we're all at this stage right now have gotten something different from this gift that's put us in these seats. 